What's good YouTube? It's your boy Damian Cryer and I'm back with another video. As you guys see, I am back in the ugly kitchen. The ugly green kitchen. So anyway, man, I hope you guys are having a wonderful and blessed Sunday today, man. Me, I am doing amazing. I got up early this morning, man. I mean, earlier than usual on a Sunday. And I decided, somebody, uh, 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 who was it? Somebody asked me to do this challenge, man. Uh, seven items in seven minutes. So actually, I was asked to, oh, God, look at this, man. It's smoking in here. Y'all see the smoke? Y'all see this? My kitchen's smoking. I better turn this on. Oh my God, I hope it's not too loud. I have to turn that on, man. Dude, I don't know what's going on. Anyway, somebody asked me in my DMs. Woo, my DMs, man. My DMs, my DMs. Somebody asked me in my DMs would I do this seven items and seven minutes challenge. So I should have actually reached out to them again and, and asked them to be more specific. So I decided to just create my own seven items in seven minutes. So right now, Oh, by the way, guys, new addition to the house. I decided to go out and buy me a crock pot and a brand new blender because me and Bing are going to start doing smoothies. And the smoothies that we're going to do, we're going to let you guys pick the smoothie of the day that we do in each video. And if we make your smoothie, we will shout you out and shout out your channel's name. So anyway, man, so today, oh my God, look at this, guys. This is crazy. Look at the smoke. Why is it smoking like that? Look at this. You guys see that? Man, what the heck's going on here? I'm about to burn my crib down. Why is it smoky like that? I don't, what the heck? That's coming from that eye, man. I fried some chicken last night. I don't know if, if, if that's the problem or not. Anyway. Anyway, 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 I am actually going to be frying some bacon, seven boiled eggs, and I'm not for sure what else I'm going to pick. I may actually get seven bags of chips. I got some of these chips up here that being picked out yesterday. So I'm not for sure what seven items I'm going to do, but now y'all know I got to cook more than seven pieces of bacon because Bing Bing probably going to want some bacon. I don't think he's going to be involved in this challenge with me. He stayed up pretty much last night with his friends playing his Xbox and having a really good time. So he's still laying down right now. But I'm going to do this seven items and seven minutes food challenge. After the video, guys, like, comment, share the video. Also, if you have a video suggestion that you want me to do, leave me a comment in the comment section down below. If you know, y'all boy going to make it happen. So as you see, this idea was sent to me yesterday through my DMs on IG. So I do listen to people and I do do videos that people ask me to do. Anyway, I have one, two, three, four, five, six slices of bacon in there. Of course, I have to add more bacon. And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven boiled eggs. And I'm actually, when I turn the camera back on, I'm gonna figure out, cause I think I should do three items. Three items in seven minutes. So I'm gonna actually turn the camera off and then try to find, I'm not, sorry about the sweat guys. I actually went to the hand car wash this morning and got my car detailed. Um, so that's why I'm a little sweaty. I had to come in and try to get everything ready for the video. Um, so I'm gonna actually find another item I can cook to add seven items to make the video a little bit better for you guys. So I'm gonna turn this off and I'm gonna see you guys as soon as I'm done cooking. Don't go anywhere. Okay guys, so I am back. I finally got the food done. So I have seven slices of bacon. It's actually eight, I kind of overcooked. Um, I got seven boiled eggs. I have seven orange slices. It's actually eight. Um, I cut four oranges, so it, it actually came out to eight. Uh, no, I cut two oranges, but I cut them in sections, so it came out to eight slices. This video right here came with a video suggestion from the Elliott family of seven. I don't, I, I just look back at stuff 
on a post that they sent me on IG. So I don't think this was specifically what they were talking about. I think they were talking about like uh, seven minutes, uh, seven items in seven minutes from Walmart. But I've already got the food done, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this challenge in another seven minutes. And I wanna give a huge shout out to the Elliott family of seven. Thank you guys for the wonderful idea. Again, guys, if you guys have a video suggestion for me to do, leave me a comment in the comment section or you can hit your boy up on IG. Um, Lord, I've been getting a lot of messages on IG. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna say my grace and set my timer and we're gonna jump right into this video. Thank you, Lord, for this food I'm about to receive, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for watching over me, watching over my loved ones. Um, Praying for my loved ones and their loved ones, Lord. Continue to keep peace in my household, Lord. Continue to keep me positive, Lord, even at my weakest points. In the name of Jesus, amen. So, I'm going to set this timer, guys. I'm going to see if I can do this challenge. Hope you guys are having a wonderful Sunday. Again, mine started off early. I went to the car wash this morning. I want to get some more grocery shopping. Um and all that good stuff. Now today I'm actually going to take Darian um, around today and well I'll just let you guys see later on uh, what our plans are today. People have been asking us to do a cooking video today for Sunday and we're going to make that happen today. I don't know if you guys are going to get that video today. You might get it tomorrow but we're going to make that video happen because I'm going to I want Darian to start learning how to cook um, different foods and stuff. Especially at like his young age, it's like why not? Let's see here, guys. Bear with me. I should have had this set before. There we go. Okay, guys, I have it set. Hope you can see that for seven minutes. So here we go. Start with one eggs first. I got salt and pepper on too. That's why it looks dark like that. I 
won't be getting this shirt no more after today. I'm taking this shirt off. My belly's gonna be poking out. Um, like Family of seven, I lost the challenge, man. I lost the challenge. And I, uh, I just got a DM. Guys, listen. I couldn't do it. I killed the oranges. I killed the bacon. 
one and a half eggs left. I couldn't do it. I'm not a big breakfast person. So I'm sorry I couldn't do the video, but if you, I mean, finish the challenge. If you guys have a video suggestion that you guys want me to do, leave me in the comment section down below. Yeah, no, yeah, we're gonna make it happen. Oh, before I go, guys, I wanna just give like an inspirational, motivational, encouraging few words here, man. Um, as you guys know, I don't really address anything. Uh, sometimes you have to let things just speak for itself. That way people can see it for what it is. My thing is this, if you guys are in a situation, whether it's a marriage, a relationship, or just best friends or something, and someone holds something over your head, man, try to get in front of it. You guys have heard me say this in multiple videos. Don't never let someone hold something over your head. It's best to get in front of it and deal with the consequences when they come. Because if you let someone hold something over your head, you're gonna be trapped. And if you're trapped, the person's gonna always have that to hold over your head. And most likely, they're going to expose it anyway. So always try to get in front of situations, um, you know, and let things take its course. Because at the end of the day, you guys gotta realize, no matter what it is, good or bad, they're going to they're gonna put it out there no matter what. So that's my word for the day. That's my advice for the day. I love you guys. To the Elliott family of seven, thank you for this good idea. And I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. Peace.